Let's look at the solution to our BTB and BHT quiz. The question this time is which BHT entry do we access for each instruction? There are 16 entries in the BHT, and we said that we access the BHT using the lowermost bits of the instruction address that are not the same for all instructions. In this case, our instruction address has the following bits. For the move instruction here, we have C, 0, 0, 0. Because every instruction is 4 bytes in size, the lowermost two bits are never changing. They are always going to be 0 for all instructions. And now because we have 16 BHT entries, we take the next four bits, and this is the number of the BHT entry. In this case, we are accessing the BHT entry number 0. Now let's look at this other move instruction here, whose address is C004. C00 are not changing. What is changing is 4. 4 in binary 0100. Again, we discard these bits because they are never changing among instructions. And this is the number of the BHT entry. So the entry that we access here is 1. Now you can tell that for instruction 8 here, this is going to be 1, 0, so we're going to access the PHT entry number 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. If we reached 15, we would then wrap around to 0, but we never reach it, so this is really what we get.